My name is Amy. I own Bark Avenue here in Delightful Deland. And today, this is Zeke, an English Bulldog client. Uh, I'm going to use Zeke to show you how to properly have your dog's nails trimmed. Here at Bark Avenue, we use a Dremel because the dogs are much more um, willing to have their nails done using a Dremel than these nail trimmers. Um, you at home might use these big orange nail trimmers, which are wonderful, but most dogs and cats do not like the pressure of having their nail trimmed. When you put the clipper in the dog's nails and clip, it puts a lot of pressure on the toe, and dogs really do not like that. There's also no forgiveness. If you make a boo-boo, then you make a boo-boo. Here at Park Avenue, unless the dog's nails are excessively long, we use an electric Dremel. Uh, once the dogs get used to the noise of the Dremel, they usually sit and are very willing to have their nails done. It also makes a nice rounded finish on the dog's nail, where this clipper puts a nice, fresh, sharp edge on your dog's nail. This clipper actually makes your dog's nails sharper. That's why we prefer the Dremel. Um, when Zeke first started coming to us years ago, he uh, was pretty difficult doing nails. Um, he did not like his nails done, he didn't like his feet touched, and now he's very relaxed on the table. I can turn the Dremel on. Uh, now we're going to take the Dremel and actually show you how to properly Dremel the dog's nails. Um, Zeke here is pretty relaxed now. You can see we got the Dremel on, I've got his foot in my hand, and he really actually doesn't care. Um, when we Dremel here at Bark Avenue, we take the dog's foot in our hand, hold the Dremel short so we have full control, where this, you really don't have a lot of control. So we're going to take the Dremel, watch out Zeke, and you can see that his paw is completely protected by my hand. We're just going to take his nail, and you can see that it makes it nice and round, there's no rough sharp edges. So here we go, and you can see from a dog that hated his nails trimmed, he's now a really good boy. So when you have the dog's nails trimmed, come here Zeke, you can hold his foot, you're going to hold that nail and protect his foot with your hand. And then you can drummel the nails like this, and they're nice and round, no more cutting, no more jumping on you and scratching your arms and legs. And uh, that's it. That's how you drum with your dog's nails. Thanks for watching us today. Um, I wanted to show you, this is the Zeke's nails before. You can see how long they are. And these are after. You can see that they're nice, round, and smooth. And if you like our videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel as we're going to have lots of how-to videos with lots of great information. You can also visit us at www.barkabdeland.com. Have a great day.